What's up, guys? We're running down the draft prospects for it's April already, guys. It's right around the corner. Draft season, baby. Garrett Wilson is our next prospect we're looking at out of Ohio State. Six foot, 183. Guy's got some speed to burn and hell of a hands catcher. Let's look at his stats, too. He's over here, 70 catches, 1,000 yards, 12 touchdowns. Just got better as his time in Ohio State. And we're going to show it on the film. This guy can catch a ball very well and just slippery when wet, a lot of good things. But then again, when you're not covered, <laughs> it's pretty damn easy. But uh, plus, what do you like initially from Garrett Wilson? Well, like you said, I mean, we're going to see the hands. I mean, even that one, he's wide open. He catches with, with the hands, which is always great to see. So very natural hands catcher. Jump man uh, right But here. yeah, <laughs> yep, jumping and catching it. So again, Oregon fell asleep there, but. On this play here, you're really going to see how talented he is. Look at the vertical as he's going to high point this football and, and catch it with his hands. You see the hands catch. Uh, it's just really nice. Just easy vertical, catching it in traffic, and then getting the touchdown as well. Ridiculous. I mean, just the awareness of where he's at in space, and then to come down, get a foot down, his butt hits the pylon, so he gets a touchdown. But overall, that is an insane play. This one's even more ridiculous. On an island, one on one. Look at his little shiftiness here. Gets to the outside. The quarterback just throws it to an area. Watch this hands catch that we just mentioned. Look where his body's facing. He's going to turn totally around, get his hands around, and make a fighting catch as the other guy's pulling him down. The defender's pulling him down. Ridiculous. Break this down for it, me. It's it's crazy, but not only is he can catch it, but his route running is exceptional. Uh, so he's a very good route runner. Just the way he creates separation here, you know, faking one way, then going back the other and really, you know, going towards space because he creates more opportunity for himself. And then the quarterback throwing it up here and then his body control is just off the charts, being able to come back and catch it, get a foot down as well. Yeah, body control, awareness, using little subtle moves to create space, like little head jabs, little head fakes. Then watch this. And I'm going to get in the end zone. Like knowing where is the space too. Not just making space based off of route running, but where is the space? Everyone's going to collide down on me if I go this way. Put the stop break on and cut out upfield. That's nasty. <laughs> That's a nasty very, move. Very much so. Uh, he's just, he reminds me a lot of Joey Galloway and a lot of, you know, Bucks fans will probably remember that name. Uh, he just, he has a lot to his game that you have to like. And now being versatile, being able to utilize in the run game, as they're going to bring him around on an end around. And they caught him by surprise, obviously, and off off to the races. Yeah, and This is something you need in the game. It's not just an outside receiver. He can be used in a multitude of ways. I mean, a Swiss Army knife, so to speak. He doesn't just have to be a speed threat. He could be a slot guy. He could be an outside guy. But the thing is, he can do all these things. And teams will covet that. And then when you have great route running on top of it, watch him sell this. Watch him sell this thing. Oh, Watch the head fakes. Watch the hard cut inside, back outside. And the safety's like, what the hell is he doing? Is he going in, out? I don't know. And that indecision is a good decision for Garrett Wilson. What do you like with that? Right. And I think you mentioned it, the route running, I, I think, is really what separates him from this receiver class, you know, as, as being one of the top guys in this draft because you have to be able to get open. And his ability to get open consistently, I think, is going to really help him at the next level, especially with the athletes that you go up against daily, you know, with the corners and safeties being faster than ever. You have to be able to get open, and he does that on the regular here in the college level. Yeah, route running, and I can't stress this enough, it was the first words I said about him, a hands catcher. Natural hands catcher plucks this damn thing out of the air. Like, pop, that's mine. You never let him, never really see him let it come to his body. That's, that's like, to me, a trait of a, a great wide receiver. Almost like DeAndre Hopkins, how he attacks the ball, brings it down. Almost same in his body type, too. He's not huge, six foot, barely 190. And the thing is, he's attacking the ball. He's not attacking the player. He's looking at this little cut. Subtle little head jab, get my body down, make this cut, get open. And what's he going to do? Is he going to let it come to his body? Yeah, a little bit on that one, but still, his hands are all right there. I really like him as a clean prospect. Right, and I agree. Definitely a clean prospect. I just look at the space that he's creating for himself. That is really coveted at the next level. you got to have receivers that can get open. And 
you know, as a, as a Bucks channel, you know, we've seen like Tyler Johnson struggle with that because he doesn't have that athleticism to get open consistently. Um, and when you can route run like uh, Garrett Wilson can, and obviously with the speed as well to, to separate like this, it, it makes you that much better and, and should be a high draft pick because of it. Yeah. When you have speed and route running ability, what you just mean is like, look at the head fake bringing his body down and then exploding out of the cut. I mean, that's high level attributes and then coming back to the ball too. Not just turning this, coming back to the 50 and then turning his body around. Let me make a move, get up field. I mean, there's a lot of things to like that he's probably putting himself up there with the top two or three receivers in this draft class. And I can't say it enough His going up high pointing. Look at that plucking it out of the air, getting down two feet, getting up field. Plus tell me more about this one. Really, uh, we, yeah, I can't stress enough. Probably maybe the best hands in this draft um, as far as just consistency and, and really being able to just make plays like this. Again, showing off the vertical, catching the ball at its highest point, securing it once he comes down with it. Just very consistent. Uh, again, here, creating that separation, making plays after the catch as well, dragging defenders, getting more yards. So really a, a prospect that, yeah, should be coveted pretty high in this in this draft coming up. And, well, he's a guy that normally prospects, they time really well in the, in the combine. They're like, oh, I didn't see that in tape. You see his natural vert on a lot of these plays. You see his natural speed on a lot of these plays. He didn't have many like just straight go routes. I don't know why. I think Olave got mainly all those. But still, his awareness to see space. Okay, I'm just turning around. They're all in the zone. I'm going to find my hole in the zone and hit me, quarterback. I'm presenting as a target. See, even throwing the hands out there, bring it here. <laughs> but that's something guys will really value that play in the slot. Present yourself as an uh, option to the quarterback. And then winning against man, he's covered. He's 100% covered, but the quarterback trusts him to get off the ball and catch the ball for me. What do you like with that one? Well, I think it's also like displaying his physicality too. I mean, we've seen a couple of times where he's got defenders, you know, all over him and he's still making tough contested catches. And I think that's another big thing at the next level where you got to make these like grimy type, you know, contested catches consistently uh, because guys are going to be on you most of the time. You're not going to get separation all the time, but his ability to like, like this one, be able to come back to the football, make a hands catch, take the contact as well, I think is, you know, something to behold of, especially at the next level. Uh, you know he hears this guy coming down about to lay the wood, right? And still maintaining the catch, coming down with the ball, not being afraid of getting hit. Like still right here. Look at the top of your screen here. Still doing his little subtle cuts, turns around, makes the catch. This guy's going to hit him from behind. He knows it's coming. It's cold, probably hurts, but gets out of the tackle, slips away. Like I mentioned, slippery when wet. There he is, like slipping out of tackles, slipping out, swoop, getting a first down. I like it. Keep going on. This is more, we mentioned, didn't really get that many big deep plays, but he can. <laughs> the quarterback just has to hit him. So speed threat, check the box, 4 3 eight, 40. I'll take it. What do you like with that? Yeah, it definitely checks checks the box. And I just like the little su subtleness of that little, you know, stop and go there almost. As you'll see at the top right here around the 40-yard line, just that little stop right there. It's very subtle, but he sells the corner, and he's already by him because he thinks – you know, oh, it might be a comeback. No, it's not. And then he just runs by him. And obviously the quarterback just got to put it on him a little bit better. But yeah, I mean, with Garrett Wilson, I, I think he's a complete receiver. I think he can do a lot of different things. And I wouldn't be surprised if he's the first receiver taken in this year's draft. And with that said, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of Garrett Wilson out of Ohio State. Uh, be sure to check out our other video on uh, Chris Olave, his teammate. But let us know what you guys think of Garrett Wilson. And with that said, until the next one.